try to do the smile thing. Should I smile? Oh, yeah. Mom says I should smile more. Hi, it's me, Alish. I'm Peak Design's digital marketing director, and I'm here to tell you about our everyday messenger. So this is the first bag we made over five years ago now, and it's our original everyday and photo carry workhorse. It can work for your everyday carry, whether you're going to the gym, or you're on your way to work, or even if you're going on a little impromptu photo shoot to the top of Bernal Hill. The Everyday Messenger comes with our trademark mag latch. We invented this one for this bag, allowing for ultimate expandability while still having one-handed opening. Inside, you're gonna find our flex fold dividers, which are great for endlessly customizable configurations. I'm gonna tell you more about the dividers a little bit later, so stop asking. Also in our bags, you've got a dedicated sleeve for your 13-inch laptop, your tablet up to 12.9, or your documents. And there's also some stretchy pockets for your accessories like your charger, your cord, or your batteries. On the outside, it's got a weatherproof 400D weatherproof liner. That's right, it's that weatherproof, twice. And on the bottom, you've got 900D, which makes it more durable and also very weatherproof. These messenger bags have a 13 liter capacity that expands up to 16 liters using the mag latch system. These also include our tuck away external carry straps. So whenever you have that extra thing to take with you, you can put it on the outside. These bags adapt to however you want to carry them, whether it's in your hand like a briefcase, across your shoulder, or even sling style. And we'll show you how to use that later. So stop asking. Just like all of our other bags, we've got capture clip mounting points, so you can put your camera right on the outside of your bag, so you never miss a shot. What's capture, you ask? I'll tell you later. Stop asking. Now that we've gone over the major features of these bags, let's get into the nitty gritty. These are weatherproof, 100% recycled 400D nylon canvas shell in a DWR impregnated and double PU coated fabric. Any questions? Most of the materials on these bags are blue sign certified. That means we take a lot of care in looking at where the material came from and how it was produced, and they're certified to be as sustainable as possible. Let's do a little bit more of a show and tell around the bag. We've got a nice little padded briefcase style handle right at the top there. This is the really versatile strap where you can go straight into shoulder mode. Can even go straight over to sling mode. And there's a lot of points here of uh, different carry styles, but I'll show you that in a bit. Stop asking, will ya? The straps attach right here by these articulating rivets so they can move around with your body really easily. And on each side of the bag, you're gonna find a hidden zipper pocket. On this side, we've got a super handy key tether. And in the other pocket, I like to store my good vibes. This bag features our external carry strap system with 10 attachment points found throughout the bag. And then when you flip this guy around, you've got a luggage pass-through right here. It goes right through, see? Oh, what's that? Shut up. And on the bottom, 900D waterproof liner. All right, let's get on inside this bag. You can do it using our mag latch system down here. To open it, you're gonna pull out and down, and then just open it right on up. So you open it up to see four rungs, so you can cinch it all the way down, so you can keep a nice, tight, secure, beautiful, sleek profile. Or you can expand it by three liters to pretty much hold everything you own. Nice little zip pocket, you can put memory cards, your tablet, pencil, whatever you have in there that you want easy access to. Right underneath it, nice little logo by our very own Lawrence Lander. Glad that guy's not here. And on the front here, you've got a great secure pocket for your passport, memory cards, credit cards, birthday cards, Christmas cards, all the cards. So let's get on into the bag where we've got a couple more stretchy pockets on either side. So you can put in your accessories. You don't want that stuff rolling around in your bag, scratching up your gear when you're on the move. This will keep them nice and secure while you're moving. Because, you know, I don't know why I said moving again. Last but not least, inside you've got two flex fold dividers. So you might be asking, what makes these flex fold dividers unique? Well, let me tell you, they fold, they make little cubbies, 
They make little shells, and I'll tell you what, they're not going anywhere. That's strong Velcro, I guarantee it. That was just like to loosen up the jowls. Yeah. I'll show you a little bit more about these flex fold dividers and how to use them to organize your gear a little bit later. So let's talk carry options. You've got the beefcake handle right here. Just kidding, it's a briefcase handle. Hey Mike, you got those billboard creatives ready? We've also got our padded shoulder strap. And messenger style carry. On the adjuster right here, you've got a little handle that pops up. I like to hold the strap right here, pull out from my body, pull up to loosen and pull down to tighten. Click it back into place when you're done. And if you're not finding the fit just right, let me show you how to adjust it. Go ahead and come down here to these length adjusters. Just feed out however much you need, and then just tuck the excess webbing right in these little convenient pockets. Oh, what's that in there? A pro tip! So say you're about to go on a big old crazy bike ride. You've got your goggles on, you've got your helmet on, and you're ready to hit the trails. You gotta keep this bag more stable. To add some stability to the bag while you're riding your bike or doing anything active, you're gonna take one of the external carry straps included with the bag. Go ahead and start with the fixed end, not the adjustable side, and attach it to the bottom external carry loop right here on the back of the bag, closest to the padded side of your shoulder strap. You're gonna hear a nice satisfying pop. Go ahead and grab the external carry strap. Find the hypalon loop right here. Slide it in and tighten until it's secure. And now I'm ready to ride. And remember, all of our products are about having quick, instant access to your gear. Grab the adjuster, loosen, swing the bag around, one-handed access straight into your bag, and boom, your camera's out so you don't miss that shot. When you're ready to move again, close the bag back up, swing the bag around to your back, and use the adjuster to cinch the bag up so it's nice and tight. Also, this is the detachment point in case you want to flip it if you're a lefty. Let's talk capture compatibility, this little guy. I'm gonna show you how to put it on the bag so you can carry your camera outside of your bag so it's more accessible and you got a little more room inside. If you're not familiar with capture, head on over to that instructional. Let's go ahead and show you how to mount it on the back. There's two attachment points. You're gonna to wanna to put it on the opposite side, furthest away from the padded part of the strap, closest to your dominant hand that you actually carry your camera with. So for me, it's this side of the back. So to install, go ahead and loosen the right side bolt. And I actually like to take this left side one all the way out. Just makes it a little bit easier when I'm putting it in. Open it up from the back side of the capture clip attachment point. Go ahead and slide it through. Take the bolt that we removed earlier. Just put it in a couple turns so that it's there. Swing it closed. Kind of get it level with the bottom of the bag. And then tighten your bolts. It's designed to grip by itself with just a few turns. So just nice and snug until it's not moving. Gonna throw the bag on. Grab my camera. Snaps right in. I'm ready to go. Remember, I can tighten this up. Nice and snug, We're ready to go. This is a great spot to have your camera. A, you'll never miss that shot because you can always get to it. But also, let's say you're in Amsterdam and you needed a little bit more Gouda in your life. Well, you got a little extra room in your bag. You get a big old thing of Gouda, maybe even a wheel. Take it home with you, treat the family. Isn't that nice? So you've maxed out your bag, you're on the top rung, fully loaded in here, and you still got one thing left to carry. It's time to use the external carry straps. Oh, look at this. My Peak Design tripod just arrived. I'm gonna wanna take this with me. Let me show you how to attach it to the bottom of the bag. So we're just gonna grab two of the external carry straps. I'm gonna take the fixed end and find an external carry loop right here. Remember, wait for that satisfying pop. 
Do the same on the other side. Boop. Now, whether you're carrying your tripod or anything, it's a good idea to find a loop or something to secure it to the strap. That's not on there, that's fine. We're just gonna tighten it up as best we can. But on the sleeve that comes with your travel tripod, there are these handy Hypalon points of attachment. I'm gonna feed the flat hook through these. And then take it and attach it. And again, wait for that pop. Same thing over here. When I have them nice and securely attached, I'm gonna tighten it just by pulling on this. I'm just gonna clean up the slop by pulling through and using these elastic strap stays to keep it nice and tidy. Now you're good to go. When you need to take it off, just go ahead and pull up to loosen the straps slightly, and then you'll have enough slack to take them off the loops. And remember, you've got 10 of these points all over the bag. Four down here, six up here, maybe even a couple mystery ones. No, there's none, just 10. So these are our flex fold dividers. They are origami inspired so you can manipulate them into full shelves, create little cubby holes so you can put a lens down here or in top, and also super strong Velcro so they fit inside securely, or you can just take them out so you can create a nice open space to put bigger items. Oh, hey guys, it's me, Alish. Just on my way to work, that's right, yep. And got my everyday messenger, everything I need for the day. We wanna take a look? Let's do it. Remember that one-handed open? I always carry around my mirrorless camera with a 2470 on there. That's my workhorse, obviously very versatile lens. I've got a speed light. And again, what's great about these flex fold dividers, you can create these shelves. So down underneath this one, I've got 50 millimeter lens. That's nice when I want a smaller profile. I'm on the street, kind of want to be a little bit more incognito. Noise canceling headphones, really important because I work with a lot of loud, annoying people. And I've also got a wireless mouse because uh, I'm getting old, I get that carpool tunnel. So that trackpad gets a little old. Got my fast charger here for the MacBook. It's pretty sweet. In here, up top, I've got a nice little portable solid state hard drive my USB sticks, and of course, plenty of SD cards. And nice little pocket up here for my external battery. ABC guys, always be charging. Little, little cord for it for my iPhone. Remember these side pockets? That's right guys, I own AirPods. I live in San Francisco, they're in my ears at all times even when I'm ordering a coffee. And last but not least, I have my house keys on the key tether included in this bag. Super handy, because I would lose my head if I wasn't attached to my body. Oh yeah, and actually, I forgot. What's more important at work than my 13-inch laptop? <clears throat> What's more important at work than my 13-inch laptop? Put that there. And you know, again, I live in San Francisco, so I have lots of stickers on my laptop. That tells people, hey, I'm pretty cool and approachable and I care about stuff. Last but not least, I've got my Kindle in here because I'm trying to get on that Instagram account, hot guys reading on a subway. So this is what I carry around on a daily basis. What I really love about this bag is obviously the flex fold dividers. With a camera like this, when I've got a long lens on it, I fold one side down fits in there perfectly, and I still have my grip accessible. So I can just reach in here, grab it, get out immediately. Pretty great. What's next? So what did we learn today? Well, 
we learned that these bags are sustainably made with Blue Sign certified materials. They fit your lifestyle, the way you carry your gear, all while making it instantly accessible. The messenger bag is how we cut our teeth in the bag design world. And we've learned a ton about materials, design, and accessibility. And we've put that all into this latest version of the Everyday Messenger. If you have any more questions, head on over to our website and check out the FAQs, or email us at info at peakdesign.com, where Jen or Dan or Francis will be happy to help. Thanks for coming by. On top, we've got a padded handle for briefcase style carry. Hold on a second. What's that, Mike? Yep, yeah, I need those billboards ASAP. No, I, I can't. He's got me on hold. Yep, 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 that, uh, I'm still here. <laughs> 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 yeah, that's all I got.